Hey, what's going on guys? The Horror Man back with the next video in Bravo's Scariest Movie Moments Challenge discussing A Nightmare on Elm Street. I'm sure this film needs no introduction, but for those of you living under a rock, a Nightmare on Elm Street is a 1984 horror film, written and directed by Wes Craven. A scene from the movie appears on Bravo's list of the 100 scariest movie moments at number 17. That scary movie moment selected by Bravo is Tina's death scene, The Revolving Room. Tina, played by Amanda Weiss, is brutally murdered as her boyfriend Rod watches on, shocked. He sees Tina being dragged around the room, off of the bed, up the wall, and across the ceiling. Unable to defend her against a killer he can't see, he witnesses four straight blade marks slice her open. Then she drops to the bed and blood splashes all over Rod's face. It's such an iconic sequence, and one that had viewers scratching their heads at the time. How was it filmed so that Tina was on the ceiling while Rod was on the floor in the same exact shot? That mystery element, I'm sure, contributed to this scene being the number 17 scariest movie moment in Bravo's list of the 100. This here, by the way, as you can see, is my media VHS release of A Nightmare on Elm Street. While Tina's death scene is undeniably iconic, I wouldn't necessarily agree that it's the scariest movie moment in the film. I personally find Nancy's dream sequences scarier. The scariest, in my opinion, is the nightmare she has in class. She sees the bloody dead body of Tina sitting next to her in a clear plastic body bag. She then sees Tina in the body bag being dragged down the hallway, leaving a trail of blood behind. This whole sequence is the creepiest to me. Another worth mentioning, though, is Nancy's next dream sequence. She again sees lifeless Tina, but this time what appears to be a giant centipede crawls out of her mouth. And down by her feet are a bunch of snakes. The last scary movie moment in A Nightmare on Elm Street I'd like to mention, despite there being many more, is the bathtub scene. Seeing Nancy get pulled down into what appeared to be a bottomless pit of water is terrifying. Like I said, there are plenty of other scary movie moments in the film as well, but I'll leave it at that. This is a popular one, and I'm sure everyone has seen it. Which begs the question, which scene in A Nightmare on Elm Street do you consider scariest? Do you agree with Bravo's pick of Tina's death? as the number 17 scariest movie moment in the list of the 100? Or would you have selected something else? Comment below and let me know. As always, please be sure to check out Jason's video as well to hear his thoughts. Which of Bravo's scariest movie moments will we cover next? Check back soon to find out. Until then, thanks for watching guys. Hit that thumbs up and be kind, subscribe. <laughs>